Welcome back to Magic Tarot. It's Jasmine with a three-card spread for the zodiac sign of Sagittarius for the month of October 2019. Sorry about the noise in the background I'm with my family and their recording, so there's really nothing I can do about it. I hope you can hear me. <clears throat> and I do have a little bit of a cold, so my voice might go in and out. Anyway, let's get started. This is the Knight of Wands in the reverse. You have the Four of Cups in the reverse and the Fool. So let's get started with the first one. Okay. It looks to me that an ex is going to be coming back in. Now remember, we're going to be entering Mercury retrograde in November. And we're in the shadow phase in the last two weeks of October. So it's going to bring in a lot of exes. The exes are going to return. Things from the past are going to return. But for you, Sagittarius, in the month of October, I'm seeing an X returning. Could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Okay. So, this X, now this is the past position. So, this X in the past was disorganized. He was out of control, chaotic. Um, he was not trustworthy. He was a cheater, a liar, jealousy. He had a lot of jealousy. There was a lot of jealousy in your relationship, personal conflict, insecurity, self-doubt. I mean, I'm seeing, hearing so many things like that. Vulnerability. Those are just a few words to uh, describe the Knight of Wands in the reverse, okay? He wasn't a very good person. That's why he's an ex. And that's what you were uh, experiencing, um, <clears throat> you know, when you were with him. And plus, he was a player. Okay, he went back out. He went out and... Um, you got rid of him, so but it looks like he might be trying to come back in. But in the meantime, you were in this position where you didn't want to accept nothing. You see how the hand of the universe is, is offering this man underneath the tree a cup of everything, but he's got his arms and legs crossed, and that's how you're feeling. But now you're going to be in the reverse. So actually, you're coming out of that phase, out of that feeling of not wanting anything, uh, and you're going to allow yourself to come out of this this and go into a new direction um you're, you're going to be feeling once again motivated to try new things i do see a new love coming in with a pisces cancer scorpio or a gemini libra and aquarius and you're going to focus on that and so if this ex does come back in you're you're most likely not going to accept them back i don't see you accepting him back um, you're going to have a great desire now to accomplish new things at work, in your life, you know, whatever it is in your health, exercise, you know, whatever it is that you're moving forward with. You, you're going to start feeling new ambition. Now that you've already grieved and put that X behind, you're going to be feeling new ambition. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so I'm seeing that you're going to try to recreate your goals and your dreams. You're going to try to make those happen, um, make those come true for you. And you're gonna, you so be prepared for new exciting changes because they are coming with this card. You're moving in the right direction, and there's renewed energy and activity, and, and it's just like a good cycle coming in for you. Okay, so now with the fool, so with the fool, you have to be careful. This is Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, so you're feeling all this great stuff, right? But see, you see, the fool here is about to fall off the cliff. He's got his eyes closed and he's looking up. He's happy. He's real happy. He's carrying his bag, going off on an adventure. But his little dog is jumping up and down saying, Stop, stop, stop. You're going to fall off the cliff. So what this card is here telling you that it's okay to go off on a new venture, you know, be excited about it and everything, but look before you leap. You know, the, the second time around, if this ex is coming back, you better think about it. You better think about it first because you're going to end up in the same position again. Just like this guy, he's not looking before he leaps. He's going to fall off the cliff and break his neck, right? So this is what this card here is telling you. If this ex is coming in, you better look before you leap or you're going to end up in the same position again. He's going to leave you and you're going to have all the all that mess again, insecurity and all that. Um, if you are going with this new person here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, uh, check him out first. Make sure he's legit, his offers are legit. You know, and he's not trying to scam you in any kind of way. I do see some scams on the internet, so be careful with that. Um, yeah, I am seeing um, somebody that you either kicked them out of the house or, or, yeah, I'm seeing that you kicked somebody out of the house in that other card. Um, also, for some of you, if you're 
moving to a new place. I see some of you moving to a new place or someone that you had living with you. Um, they're not going to pay you your rent this month. They're going to leave before you before they you collect or something like that. If you're renting a room out, you're not going to get your money. So you need to go ahead and try to collect as soon as possible because they're going to try to scam you. I'm seeing scams for some reason. Scams on the internet. Scams with money. Scams with people renting or living with you or something like that. That's what I'm, I'm hearing and I'm seeing it. All right. So, yeah, try to collect your money as soon as possible. If somebody owes you money, um, don't take someone's word and let them move in and they say, okay, I'm going to pay you next month or next week or when I get my paycheck. No, get the money first before you let anyone move in. Okay. Don't let people move in and then they say, I'll pay you in three days and then they take off and you won't never see them or the money. All right, so don't be scammed that way. Watch out for internet scams. When you, I see people emailing you and saying, well, I, I have all this money, but I need an American account to transfer it to, and you get so much. No, that's just a scam. They're trying to get your account so they can wipe you clean. Okay? So, yeah, this reading is pretty much cut and dry. There's not a whole lot to it for Sagittarius. Um, just be careful with the X. And um, try out this new person that's coming in. I kind of, I do feel like it's going to be good for you. On this one too, also, if you're getting a job offer, um, especially on the internet, there's a lot of jobs on the internet. I'm seeing that it's a scam. Okay, I keep hearing scam over and over in my in my mind. So be careful with jobs. Like, make sure it's a true, legit job. That that's going to pay you. Don't give out your information. If it's an internet job, don't give out your bank account and all that right away because you're going to end up getting scammed. All right. So make sure you it's a true, legit job. Check them out with the Better Business Bureau and make sure you're really talking to someone that's got a real position for you. And that's if it's an internet. Now, if you're going to an interview, um, you know, for a real job that you know it's a building, you know you're going to be in there. Okay, that's a whole different story. Again, make sure it's legit and make sure you're going to get hired before you quit any other job that you already have. Because you don't want to quit first and then be without a job at all, right? All right, so that is your reading for October, Sagittarius October. Um, I'm going to do more extended ones when the retrograde comes in November. Also, don't forget that I'm doing uh, personal readings. If you want one, follow the directions down below. This is just a general reading. It's not going to resonate with anybody, and I hope it does. Leave a comment. Let me know if it did or didn't, if you liked it, whatever. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Please subscribe. I'm trying to build my channel to get monetized so I can do long extended readings live. I would love to do that. All right, I will see you next time. Bye-bye.